Greetings people of YouTube, Wayne Hackman here aka Waxstar. I apologise about the quality of this video, it's done on a fairly old laptop which is my only laptop that is operational at the moment because as you can hear out in the background there is an electrical generator going um, and all of my big computer equipment is just taking up too much power. Yes, we're without power, and the reason we're without power, power is actually we were hit in, in Bermuda by a tropical storm this past weekend. It's the 14th of October today, and um, it was pretty crazy. Everyone was bunkered in for what they expected, a, a pretty bad winter storm, and winter storms hit. It gets windy, but, but we get up and get going the next day. The only problem with this tropical storm is that it turned into a hurricane at six o'clock in the morning Sunday morning and nobody was prepared for it boats got destroyed uh, garden furniture and roofs were destroyed um, nobody had closed their shutters nobody had prepared for it um, we woke up at six o'clock and well the weather was quite something um, it was amazing um, and frightening and all of the above um, so we've been at, without electricity uh, for about three days and we anticipate that we're going to be out of electricity for well quite some time um, and so I thought I'd just show you a little footage that I took here we are if you want to know what a hurricane looks like that's it and look down my tree the breaking that's our generator giving us power Look at that, that's pretty awesome really shot, isn't it? Spanish Point to check my little boat and she survived. She's down there, which I'm quite chuffed about. But uh, unfortunately there's a way there's a boat behind her that's gone over. Out. That's not so great. Um Guys seem to have survived. Joanne's boat seems to have There's a bit of damage here. Look. It's pretty bad. So you can see some during and then some after footage when I went down to check my boat. Um, fortunately, it survived. So um, we were all caught unawares. Um, it's still built as a tropical storm, but the ironic thing is the reason why they call it Tropical Storm Fay was because the weather station that records all the data blew away and they have no data to prove that it was a hurricane. But I was talking to a lot of the locals um, and many people say it's one of the worst they've seen in a number of years. Um, and. Um, I speak to a couple of other people saying that, that they've not seen this kind of damage for a long time. So it's been exciting, I hope you found it interesting. Um, those of you who pray, I just would, would request that actually in about three or four days after I, um, I've recorded this, um, we're, we're expecting a category three storm come through, certainly category two possibly three maybe even four hurricane gonzalo or gonzalo or something like that is coming through our way um so the place is crazy um we're still without electricity and i've I, i'm quite proud of myself i've built solar arrays and repaired generators and, and we're, we're pretty set set for it and fortunately the buildings in bermuda are pretty tough um but you know uh the storm that's just passed, praise God, there was no loss of life. Um, some people have lost boats and 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 their parts of their roofs and things like that. And um, and my heart goes out to those people. Um, but it's particularly this storm that's coming. We've, we're all a little bit on edge because it's it's billed as a Category Three 
possibly into the category Thor range, which, if you know anything about Hurricanes, is pretty bad. Um, so I will make another video to let you know how to go. Hopefully a little bit better quality than this if our electricity is, is restored. Um, but if you have been watching, greatly appreciate it. Please think about us and, um, and yeah, have one on me. <laughs>